box first showed up with old blue, or should I call it new blue, I knew I had to put my hands on it. Whew. This is not your everyday ordinary Red Ryder Carbine Action 200 shot air rifle. There's a lot of great features on here in box, really knocked it out of the park. We got the Gemtech 30 caliber inert suppressor, shabbily mounted to the muzzle. From there, he added a Aero Precision 15 inch handguard with M lock attachments, which was great because it enabled us to put the Crimson Trace 301 light laser combo. That's a thousand lumens of light and a green laser. Black Bark doesn't stand a chance against that. Then we've got the Magpul Vert Grip. I think they call that the RVG, the Rugged Vertical Grip. Recoil on this gun can be substantial. You want something to help you to control it. Working our way back to the sighting system, I've got a, a worn 45 degree mount with a Crimson Trace red dot on there. That's for if things get close and tight, really heated will be able to take out Black Bart and his crew. But if they go on the run and we gotta take them at a distance, we got a Crimson Trace Hardline 1 to 10 magnified optic on top. Now it doesn't have the compass in the stock. Pretty sure they don't do that anymore. We got Black Bart down range there. Take a few shots, see how this baby performs. That is a shooter. Now this isn't old blue, it's new blue. I can guarantee you this, black bard ever comes back around, he'll be pushing up daisies. To see all of Gun Talk's content, go to guntalk.com, guntalktv.com, or sign up for the Gun Talk newsletter.